where can you find melanoma? And it has been demonstrated that the anatomical locations for melanoma have some discrepancy between females and males. For example, uh, for males, the most common locations are the upper torso and the head and neck. While for female, the most common anatomical locations include the extremities, primarily the legs and then the arms. Why is it that it's so important to find melanoma early on? Uh, if you look at the classification by stages and mortality rate associated with the time of diagnosis, if you look at stage one and two, which means that the tumor is confined to the skin, versus a stage three, which is confined to the lymph nodes and the skin, and then stage four, with distant metastasis, is a significant variability on the chances to be alive at five years. For stage 1A, there is a 96% chance to be alive in five years, compared to stage 2C, uh, where it's 45%. 2C are the deep tumors that are ulcerated. If you look at stage 3C, for example, there is only 24 to 29% chance to be alive at five years. And in stage 4, uh, we only have about 7 to 19% chances of being alive at five years. So the overall response to current uh, treatment uh, for patients with a stage four is not really optimistic. Therefore, primary prevention and early detection are critical uh, on being able to uh, extend you know, the survival rate on the patients diagnosed with melanoma. We cannot emphasize enough the importance of prevention, particularly in children, uh, avoiding significance on exposure, as well as the importance of early detection by educating patients uh, to recognize early warning signs uh, for malignant melanoma.